Global financial markets have had a more volatile ride in 2018. There's been a fair bit of turmoil in emerging markets, which has hit South African assets quite hard. Um, US markets have remained the beacon of strength within global financial markets, but the South African market has been negative year to date. So in line with other emerging markets, uh, the South African assets have performed poorly in 2018. The RAND has depreciated uh, bonds after initial rally in the first quarter have sold off heavily, as have domestic equities. We are taking care to avoid the crowded parts of, of global markets. Uh, we think popular stocks are largely very expensive, but we think one of the anomalies of current market conditions uh, is that there are significant opportunities in parts of the market that are out of favor. And here in particular, I reference South African domestic stocks, uh, where companies are very cheap on low levels of earnings, particularly um, mid-cap South African industrials, where we're finding great opportunities. And also on a stock-specific basis, there are good opportunities to mine uncrowded areas offshore. And similarly, we're finding great opportunities to buy great businesses at very low valuations. Mm -hmm.